Hi everyone. A lot of you have asked me, could you see me do my casings or shuttering? The, the proper term for this is shuttering. Um, so here it is. There's one I've done. And then a lot of you have also asked, how did I learn how to do this? Where did I pick up all my trades or all my skills that I have? I've picked them up along the way. You know, um, I never had, there is no map. There is no plans. There are no drawings for what I'm doing here. This is all in my head. It comes from my head. Um, I'm not an architect, I'm not, um, I'm not a designer, I'm nothing, I'm just John Tierney, but uh, I have an imagination, and because I have an imagination, that is why I was able to design this, and that is why I knew that when it's finished, and when the shuttering or the casing comes off it, it will look right, it's why I designed those chimneys, I knew when the casing comes off them, they look right, and when the brick goes in the middle, when I put all the brick in the middle all the way around there, in between those two bands, it would look very good. It's when I designed that bell tower. I didn't go and see a bell tower. I thought, this is what it should look like. And I would lie in bed at night and I would be thinking, yes, maybe do this or do that or, you know, one or the other. I'm not very mechanical. Um, I'm not very educated. But I suppose the one thing I have is a good imagination. So that when I do start making this, I can imagine it as I'm going along, what it's going to look like when it's finished. So this is one of the shutters. This is going to be filled hopefully tomorrow. I have the other side of the gable to do. I don't use no fancy timber. I use whatever is at hand. There's bits of chipboard there. There's bits of plywood and there's bits of uh, pine. You know, there's bits of everything. But it's built right. It's built and it will look right when it's stripped. Um, I'll, what I'll do now is I'll, uh, I'll show you this now. I'll take a picture of this now and I'll take a picture of the other one that's already done. It's exactly the same as this, but it'll, it'll let you see what I've done. Now, I've also carved the other one. Um, but that's simple to do. That is very simple to do. And, you know, I, I, I love all the people that follow me uh, for this, that watch me for this. And, you know, I can see every day that so many different people have pressed follow because I can't add anyone because I think all my friends at 5,000 are gone over the limit. And uh, so people just press follow and they see what I'm doing because I have lots of this to do. I have a big old bell mixer out the back, a big old diesel mixer, and I intend to do loads of molds, molds for garden seats, garden benches, mushroom seats, um, garden features, uh, fountains, everything. I, I, you know, the sky's the limit. When I have this part of the house finished and the ridge caps on, I have to put the ridging on then then I will be doing all my mouldings. So, you know, it's great that people just say, right, I want to see what he's doing. I'm going to press follow. So, you know, just press follow if you want to keep watching me. But as I say, I'll take a picture, I'll share a picture of one of these that's already done on the other side of the house. And this one will look exactly the same when it's finished. And as I say, the only thing I have is an imagination because uh, I don't have any plans and I don't have any drawings to follow and no one told me to do it like this This is just out of my own head because this is my folly So if you want look up the word folly what it means but this cottage is my folly. Okay. Thanks for watching Thanks for your great um, Feedback because it keeps me going. I love to read all your comments that you leave me. Thank you. Bye. Bye